my knees are feeling good again, but sometimes I do have some osteoarthritis in my left knee. And so I'm looking for something that's gonna give me the intensity that I want without impact, anything that's going to irritate those knees, keep them safe and healthy. My one piece of equipment today is a 10 pound kettlebell. And you got my, see that's my runway there, my little ramp there. I've got my yoga mat so I know my space is safe. I'm not gonna hit anything. And I've got my 10 pound kettlebell. But let's get started. So we're going to do 10 swings and then we're gonna do 10 squats, 10 more swings. We're gonna do overhead press, 10 more swings, little Romanian deadlift with that kettlebell, 10 more swings and then rows on each side. Let's get going. All right, so I got my kettlebell getting in position. Here we go. Keeping my abs in, squeezing my glutes at the top. Now I'm gonna take it and flip it up. I'm gonna turn sideways. Here's the position, I'm holding the kettlebell. Here come the squats. Trying to stay neutral. Pulling in my belly, getting some weight in my heels. Weight in the heels. Neutral spine. Turning around using a proper setup before I start swinging again. Here we go, 10 more swings. And swinging it up and holding it here. Overhead press. On a diagonal up from my chest, pulling in those abs, squeezing my legs. And again, I'm not gonna swing the bell from here. I'm gonna put the bell down, get it in proper position, and then start to swing. Keeping my shoulders down, my spine neutral. Swinging it up now, I'm gonna go into that Romanian deadlift. Touch it down, squeeze it up. Neutral spine, head in line. Touch, lift. <laughs> setting it down proper form get ready to swing hinge the hips back and swing plenty of intensity without jumping And I'm gonna go ahead and set it down. I'm going to do my non-dominant arm, arm first, 10 swings, then my dominant arm. I'm gonna lunge forward, abs tight, using my leg like a bench. So I'm putting my hand on my leg, pulling in those abs. Leverage, ready, and one, two. One piece of equipment. Resistance exercise is for everybody, especially we women who want to stay independent, strong. Down it goes, a little sideways angle. Here comes my last resistance exercise of the round and row it back. Let me show you this angle. Neutral spine. Good lunge. Pushing on my leg. I'll show you my belly. Belly. Pushing on my leg. 
helps me to draw those abs in tight, gives me leverage. Head in line, seven, eight, oh, nine, 10, and then finishing off with one more round of swings. Inhale, exhale, get in position, hike and swing. Notice that the bell is not passing between my knees, it's passing through at the top of my legs. Last one, bring the intensity. Squeeze those glutes at the top. And safely setting the bell down. I call that the dismount, grabbing some water. So I want to just talk about this concept of eat for yourself. Give yourself permission. Claim the right to eat what's right for you. A lot of people don't have my history of compulsive overeating. They don't have my history of sugar and carbohydrate addiction. I literally call myself a gluco mania. It went out of control during my pregnancy because I had impaired glucose tolerance. I didn't have gestational diabetes, but I did have impaired glucose tolerance and I had PIH, pregnancy induced hypertension. Everything went wacky. And then after my son was born, this is when I really was like off to the races with the compulsive overeating. However, I did find that what I had to do was step by step, eliminate some sugar, eliminate some sugar, eliminate some sugar, then the grains, and then the vegetable and seed oils, and then also some of the fruit that I was eating and the above ground vegetables. And what I did find, and especially after menopause, because I went into went through menopause at age 53, and I'm 56 now. When I went through the change, I became extremely sensitive to carbohydrates. And that's okay, I accept that. So this is what is working for me now. Thank you so much for watching and being here today. Check out those other videos. Check out there's leg day, arm day, back, chest, all the good stuff, Drop sugar, lift weight, but most of all, Eat what's right for you.